One time, Sam and Berry Bird invited Raven to her house for a meal. She told her kids to take their baskets out to pick berries. She started to sing her song, and as she sang, her children's baskets filled up. Today, we are out here by Ross Lake. It's on the northern side of the res. We are gathering salmon berries. It's the first berry of the season, um, and it's coinciding with the salmon run, so next week will be the salmon ceremony as well. After gathering some berries, we're gonna go back to the clinic and have lunch, and then we're gonna make uh, jam, both so that folks can have it later on in the year when the berries are no longer here after June, um, and then also just to, for folks that are interested in learning how to do like different preservation techniques, learning how to do a water bath canning. Oh, that is so good. Look at that. My mom is telling a story about her, about her parents and her grandparents going out and picking berries. And they all went as a family, and they had a big family with like seven children. It's a very good time to bond and talk and to really get to know, um, know each other, um, trailblazing and all that stuff. So it's a good way for, uh, for a family to be united and connected. They're so abundant everywhere. You know, we could go to the backyard or um, around the creek, my grandmother's house. Um, you know, they're just right in the backyard side of houses. As if uh, the berries drop on the ground, just leave it. The salmon berries themselves are really good about um, being able to start growing in like damp areas like this. So if we just leave them, both that's for the animals um, and everything else, but uh, also for the plant to replenish itself. Wow, it's almost like a gold mine here. Or is it amber? <laughs> or salmon color? <laughs> So you want to clean the berries first when you get them. There's other little bugs and stuff that lives in there. Orange one's going to taste sweeter, while the red ones are like um, a little bit more savory. Oh, the red ones seem more sour. Yeah. For every cup, you put a two-thirds cup of sugar in there. So you're going to see quite a bit of sugar, which is not something that we'd usually advocate in our program for. But yeah. since that is so much sugar in the jam, this is something that you just put a little bit on at a time and just enjoy it simply. Mm -hmm.